Hello. This video, I'm going to try to pick this FTH surveyor. It is a French pump lock with five sliders. They have false gates and the interact with some sort of, I don't want to call it a sidebar, but I'll show you after I pick it. The main difficulty is, for me at least, tensioning. Because uh, when you look at the keyway, it's round. And the only openings are where the sliders are. So I'm tensioning with this wire on, in one of the slider grooves. Um, when I started trying, I chose the first one. Turned out to be a zero lift, um, which I found out after I switched to the second uh, second slider. So if I go like this, I can just. Try to tension it like this. Let's see how it goes. There you can see the slider. You can see if it actually that is the true gate where I want to go. I wonder. I haven't tried. If I if I just look into the keyway, if I can decode it. Let's let's check that later. Okay, this one is loose. Just get behind. It's not exactly zero lift <laughs> because I had to tap it now, but it's enough to give me trouble. Open. As you can see here, don't want to move it too far but if I do this you should be able to see it will move freely do you see that so let's close it up again let's have a look yeah might be able to See if it's no, of course not, because the grooves are on the out, uh, outside. Never mind, chopping rubbish. Let's cut this thing. Okay, to gut it, there we go. To gut. Okay, um, need to first remove that grub screw over here. Then there's a pin that has to drop out. There we go. After that. We can do this.
This is the actuator. You see the springs there. Let's turn this over. This can be removed. Then I'm going to remove this spring. Let's keep a finger on it. I want to, don't want to send it flying. Easier when I tried for the first time. <laughs> Don't know what's going on now. I'm missing something. I'm always missing something. There we go. So, put this to the side. Then we can see the sliders. Let's get those out. I'll show them later. Um, start with one. Like this. Two. Three. Now I can take off the, well, let's just call it a sidebar. And that's the way it looks. When a locked position, the sliders are in those semicircle openings. And when they're set correctly and the true gate is at the correct position, uh, that part it, it, uh, can slide through the opening and uh, the ah. plug can rotate. Let's put this here. Put the one on the right over here. There are springs in there. Let's get those out as well. There's one still in there. Before we look at the pins, sliders, let's just. I really like the way it's looking. It's so weird. Nothing like we're used to over here. Some time in history, those French lock designers went the way of the pump lock. <laughs> I love it. They, they've got so such weird designs. Not in, not only the pump locks, but also uh, the the monopoles. I'll try to pick that soon. Uh, and the fichets, uh, beautiful, beautiful stuff. I love it. It's weird. Uh, okay, got distracted. Let's take a look at the sliders. So. If you look at a slider, you can see this is the uh, ah. this nub is on the inside 
here and um, that prevents rotation I'll show it like this as you can see it stays in the correct orientation um, and these are now you can see the very wide true gauge and those false gates seem small but they bite hard so once you're stuck in one of those uh, unless you find a way to play with the tension very precisely uh, you'll drop everything very nice um, is there anything else to show That you, there you can see uh, see those circles that's where the side part rests uh, so when you uh, try to rotate the the, the, the plug uh, the side bar can't rotate in the in the housing uh, so unless um, the sliders are at the correct position uh, the sliders will won't be able to get past those parts that are coming uh, coming in these parts uh, and when they're in the correct position at the true gates they can just slide past so the, the plug can rotate uh, I, I hope I'm explaining it well enough uh, I think it's very ingenious Um forgot to show you one thing. Let's do a quick re uh, partial reassemble reassembly. Because I want to show the position of the sliders when the uh, the key is inserted. for now and take the key like this so when you look at those you can see the sliders and when I enter the there are the true gates and now it's closed can actually see a little bit of spring there huh. okay so that, that's how this works and then the well now right now when the key is insert, inserted the <coughs> hard to do this I need an extra hand but I don't have that one so this as you can see well the, the cyber this this uh, this can just slide so you can rotate and when the wrong key is inserted or the key isn't inserted this won't be able yeah only a, a tiny tiny bit uh, it's uh, stuck in place so well I'm going to reassemble this thing off camera and uh, going to wish you a, a very nice day and thank you for watching and hope to see you soon. Bye bye.